What's up with this boy Oscar De La Hoya, a.k.a. Oscar De La Moisture? Uh, talking about Deontay Wilder would be bigger than he he is if he had Deontay, promoted Deontay Wilder. First of all, dude, you had the opportunity to do that. You wasn't getting him the big fights that he needed. So he went over to Al Heyman and Lou DiBella, and he's getting the fights he pretty much wants uh, so far in terms of title shots and all that. But he ultimately going to get that Anthony Joshua fight. The fan pressure, the fan demand is going to be too much for him not to get what he wants out of Anthony Joshua. It might take a year or two, but he's going to get there. So Oscar De La Hoya, if you have so much influence, why did you allow him to leave Golden Boy? Let's just keep this a, a buck ten. You know what I'm saying? If you was that big of a promoter, he wouldn't have had to have uh, jumped ship with uh, Al Heyman and Lou DiBella. But the fact that you say some stupid shit like this is, is <laughs> asinine as fuck. It's fucking asinine as fuck in... Oscar De La Hoya, you should have took the money from Al Heyman and pay, and you should have took the money from Al Heyman, dude. Real talk. I mean, Richard Schaefer wanted to sell that company, and you blocked that shit, and your ego got in the way. That's why you and Richard Schaefer wasn't talking for months at a time. Y'all was publicly seen not talking to each other, and and now Richard Schaefer is winning. Richard Schaefer created the Super Six. Uh, super middleweight and cruiserweight championship and he's winning on your bitch ass and he got access to money that you don't have remember you know what I'm saying from what I understand I'm not 100% sure on this from what I understand um, Oscar De La Hoya had, had secured a loan to start Golden Boy promotions through Richard Schaefer this is something that is documented you know what I'm saying? This is what been said. Now, I don't know the full detail, how much money that Oscar De La Hoya had to put, but it was a loan that secured Golden Boy Promotions because he was going through that hell with Bob Arum and shit like that. So Oscar De La Hoya need to cut that shit out. He, he's a clown. He, he needs to go back and do rehab, real talk, because you a joke at this point. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't going to keep on doing too many videos on Oscar De La Hoya unless he just really say some asinine ass shit that, that I dislike but other than that I'm not going to be doing as many videos as you think I am because this dude is a real cross dressing attention whore that's why I call the motherfucker Oscar De La Hoya Oscar De La Moisture I mean, he's a real fuck boy and you need to address those racist emails by the way if you want black fighters to do business with you you need to address those racist emails you can't sit up here and act like race, racism don't exist and your company is full of shit in terms of racism and shit like that they 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 you caught got caught red handed just come out and say golden boy promotions don't uh condone that shit but instead you want to you want to hold on to that to that kkk shit you know what i'm saying you should have been came out and made a statement for that it takes you that long to make a statement. Obviously, you a, you a bitch, and I, I don't even want to <laughs> hear from this motherfucker. Anyway, this your boy live and direct, full effect out the eight three two. Y'all already know how I do.